This is a donkey cap machine. What's great about this particular piece of equipment is it not only works the meaty part of your calf in the back, but it also works the really sexy high heel muscles on the side. So in all seriousness, if you're looking for a well-rounded calf workout, this is the machine you want to choose. The first thing you do is set your weight and you put the pin. So very much like our standing calf machine, should you outgrow the weight stack, there's plenty of space to add free weight at the top. Your next adjustment is going to be for your, basically your hip height, and that happens here. This has got a little bit of weight to it just so you're prepared. You pull the pin and you adjust for your hip height. The last adjustment you need to look at is at the bottom of the machine, and this is where you're going to stand. You're going to put the balls of your feet on this black taped area. It has two adjustments, and you pull the pin and slide it back. What you want to do is make sure the balls of your feet and your ankles are directly under your hips. So I'll show you with my trusty assistant, Tim. Here he comes. Ready to work your calves? Yes, absolutely. All right, so you want your hips, not your low back, but your hips under there. That's good. So once you have the balls of your feet on the block, you notice his hips and his ankles are right in line. Elbows are on the front pad and you're going to grab the handles in front, not to squeeze, just to stabilize. Core is braced, back is flat, so we're ready to go. Soften your knees and come up onto the ball of your feet. You're going to get a nice stretch right here at the bottom of the motion. Make sure you drop below your toe line. And on that extension, make sure you don't lock those knees out. Lift and lower, and you also get a great hamstring stretch.